recently came out added a bunch of really cool cards to the game and i've been trying to climb the ladder with pretty limited knowledge of all the new cards in there but this deck that we're working on right now is a Cthune deck but it's, it's about like Cthune and drawing cards so um the thing is you can play cards like this and with the rogue cards you can return it to your hand and then play it again and then return it to your hand and play it again and then add three copies to your deck and wow that's a really strong minion for this turn um huh wow that's gonna be something that what we got i think we're just gonna play it safe and return it for now i don't really know how to deal with something like that but yeah this you know this deck is like drawing cards getting these minions out bringing them back to your hand getting them out again and then getting a super buffed up cthulhu getting two mana crystals okay that's all right though. That gives us a good chance to gain some board control now. That's like a decent card. A four with a divine shield. That's a four two. I think a lot of these cards, like the Cthune cards that are out, have like a really good stats considering they're also buffing up your Cthune. Cthune. I hope I'm saying that right. I don't know. All right. What can we do? Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, we can kill it. Should I do Fan of Knives? Um, it'll give us some card draw. So, yeah. We went for it. Hope that was not a mistake. But I can't imagine this guy's gonna have too many low level cards, right? By low level, I mean low health. Because he's playing some big boys, getting his mana up real quick. Oh, man. And there's one. Oh. That seems like a pretty overpowered card. What the world? What in the world is that? Okay. Well. I don't know. We could fan of knives it. Take out one guy. Let's see. Let's draw. Okay. Um. I guess we'll just clear him. But I'm not sure what to do about this guy. I'm not sure. We can get him in next turn, Doomcaller, so that'll be a big minion to get out there. Maybe this... No, he would die. That'll have to do. Ah, I forgot to use my hero power. If I lose, that's the reason. That's alright. Keep trucking forward. This guy's got a lot of cards in his hand, too, so... I don't know. It's going to be hard to deal with. So in about 12 hours, I'll be taking a flight to China, spending some time in Beijing to do some air pollution research and maybe some watershed research in uh, Xiaomen. So that's going to be pretty fun. And instead of packing, I'm hanging out recording videos right now. So I hope you guys like this. Oh no, 14 damage to the face. Oh, good lord. I have no way to deal with that unless preparation deal damage and if I draw an assassinate I didn't get it dang well yeah that's gonna that's gonna do it for us I think although he is doing well he's gonna have a 14 a 14 13 and there is nothing I can do about it yeah we lost this one Wow. I don't know how to deal with that. That was just insane. Alright. Let's pick up our mage deck. Old trusted mage. This deck is so fun. It's about casting spells. About denying them from getting any minions. And then turn 10. Dropping the minion that casts a bunch of random spells. So it'll be fun. So this is one of the maps that came out a while ago. And I never figured out how to interact with it. I know that this shoots a laser, this bounces, and you can trip this wire. Maybe you can't. It just shoots arrows. But, like, what else can you do? There's a thing. A little coin. There he is. Yogg Saron. Hopes in. Crafted this bad boy. Probably shouldn't have, but man, he's just so fun when you get him out there and he just starts spewing spells randomly. 
and almost every time I used him so far, I've gotten an entire board com an entire board clear. Where th whether it's like a brawl or something else, it's amazing. Um, let's just get this out. That way we can take what he plays next turn. This dude's rank 14, top 25% in ranked play this season. My best current rank is standard. Top 30%. I gotta beat this guy. I wonder what his deck is like. You just don't know what to expect anymore with the uh, with the expansion. Out. All right. Um. Let's see. I could freeze it. I'll give him two armor. I don't really want to waste a spell on it though. Get him three turn four. I wouldn't have a play either. Gotta do nothing, and I don't like doing that. But, I guess if I played him, he would die, and I think he's a little too valuable, because that's going to be a lot of value getting two spells out of this guy. Okay. Well, that's not the card we wanted. Yep. I think we'll just ping him. And, uh, let's get this out. More spells we cast, more powerful this guy gets. And if I can get Bronzebeard out and then play him, oh my gosh, the dream will come true. That'll be amazing. I think it's a pretty cool card too. He's like a giant mouth with a bunch of little mouths. Yeah. Alright, let's get a clear on this boy right here. So this is generally how this deck is played from my understanding, at least how I do it. I just kind of slow the game down as much as I can, use all my clears for everything, steal his minions, best card ever, and go from there. If he doesn't play anything, we can get this down and maybe get something good again next time. Yeah. Give me a big drop. Or Emperor, actually. Hmm. Mm. Oh, do I do Emperor or do I play this and draw two? Let's see, if I do Emperor, he'll reduce all of these. That'll give me a pretty good combo. Let's do Emperor. I can keep him out two turns and just get um, Yogg, Saron, and Bran at the same turn. That would be the dream, but I'm pretty sure I'll clear it. Yep. One mana, six damage. Talk about a good card. I don't even own that card, actually. I've never gotten it in a pack. Okay, so our spells cost one less. Let's do that. Play that. Draw. And get some shields out. Just trying to cast everything right now. <laughs> and I'm at seven, so yeah, we're going to freeze him. I don't want him to be able to clear these because I want to keep her out there. So next turn we can use Brand Bronze Beard, Ethereal Conjurer, get two spells and go from there. Well, that's okay. He did not get the card draw from it. Okay, Bronze Beard. Discover two spells and let's get some low cost spells we can spam, like that one. And, ooh, Pyroblast. Nope. This one. More taunts, more power. Alright. I might be trying the dream next turn. If he doesn't clear my bronze beard, we will try the dream next turn, and it might be amazing. It's kind of a risk, but since we have total board control right now, it's not a huge risk. And whatever minion he plays, I'm going to get. So even if he plays his Cthulhu, I'll have the perfect answer. Or if it comes to it, we got these bad boys to drop. Amazing. Amazing. So let's see what we get. Maybe he got too scared of my taunts. My zero two taunts made him run away. Hello. Hello. What now? I'd like to do my combination. There we go. Do you hear it's cold? There we go. Thank you. I'm actually going to have to kill one of my minions to play Yogg's Ron next turn. 
Oh, he killed it for me. Thank you, my friend. Alright, so do I play him now? Or do I cast more spells and then play him? I mean, I probably should just get him out now. Since I have bronze beard, so... Six to the face, or should I clear it? Six to the face is a lot. And we'll clear... Let's just attack face. I don't know. Alright, the dream. Attack. Give him plus two, come on. Oh, lovely. Not one of mine, not one of mine. Okay, that's a taunt. Four damage to him. The chance of it on me is a lot higher. That sucks. That also is not a good one. Hey, that's a good one. That's a good one. Restore for me. That's not good. Yes! Draw a card. Oh, yeah! Divine shield. I guess I'm going to be able to attack at some point, so I might as well do it now. Oh, this is just beautiful. Ooh. Well. They can't be reduced below one health, though. That's cool. But they're all at one now. Is that going to go on my minion? Of course it is. Okay. What the heck? That's gotta be kind of frustrating for him to deal with, because I literally would have killed my entire board with that deal 5 damage to all minion spell. Hey, it didn't give me overload, though. That's pretty cool. Oh, I wish it would have given him all plus 2, plus 2. That would have been really, really big. We got a 7 1, 8 1, and everything's going to turn into a 2 2 tree end when they die. So, that's a pretty powerful board. Drop you Sarah next turn. I'm not sure how he's going to handle this one. Hello. Even a brawl at this point wouldn't do it. Oh yeah. Going to kill him? Okay. So he's low on cards. We have insane board control. Our taunts are turning into tree ants. That's so awesome. Alright. Let's see, let's just ping him like that. And let's get our Yosera. Oh, it looks like I still have a weapon, too. What a satisfying way to end the game. I kind of like the Yosera card that does 5 damage to all characters but her, just because that's a good way to finish him. It's a guaranteed 5 to face, although I do have a 12 to face, so... I think I won. Like, I don't see a way he could kill all of these minions twice, plus these and Yosera, while dealing- Yeah, yeah. Well played, my friend. Well played. Well played. Alright, let's get one more in here. Play the mage deck, because it's so fun. Alright, looks like we're against a rogue this game. So, I don't know. We have a 2, 3, 4, and 5 drop. I don't see any reason to re-roll. I might get rid of the polluted hoarder. He's not got the best stats for a 4 drop. I like drawing the card, and I like the pressure he puts on the board with 4 attack, but I'm pretty sure I could sub something in a little more cost-efficient. Ooh, that's a cool card. A nice golden brand new one. Very cool. Yeah, I get that board control. I love golden taunts too. They're probably my favorite goldens. So, uh, in this research trip I'm going on, I'm supposed to bring my laptop, and last night I think the hard drive failed. So I've been completely unable. Ah, two mana. I've been completely unable to turn my laptop on. So all day I've been trying to diagnose it, doing all kinds of repairs with command prompt. Still not working. And I have like 12 hours till my flight leaves, so. That's gonna be uh, something interesting to deal with, I think. Let's get Spell Slinger out there. Oh, what a good one to get. Summon all three Beast Companions, wow. That's actually the second time I've gotten that from a Spell Slinger. 
Oh, that's cool. Alright. Let's do... Three. Um... Let's get him out there. And I think we'll just go face. That way next turn we can ping him with a forgotten torch fireball combo. Dang it! Spell Slinger, what are you doing? That's not what we wanted. Alright. Let's take him out then, I guess. Not the most efficient trade, that's for sure. But once we get the beast control, whatever, call of the wild out, we'll have a lot of board control. <laughs> this guy's name is Blastoise. I'm kind of worried though. Depending on what he plays this turn, it might be pretty big. Okay, I can deal with that. I can deal with that. Ouch. Four to the face. Okay, I'll ping him out. That gives me four mana. Play this secret and take what he drops. And then next turn, we'll coin out Beast Companion. And then I think that'll give us board control. Also, it kind of depends on what he plays this turn for us. Wow. Golden Blood Mage. I really don't need that card draw either. I do not need it at all. Alright, yeah, we're just going to coin it out because I think we need it. He won't expect it, that's for sure. Should probably deal with him. That's a lot of spell damage. Still has one, but a 5-4 and a 2-4 is nice. Then if we can buff them both up. The Bronze Beard Ancient Mage combo. That'll give plus four spell vamp. The dream. Uh, he's going to clear it. Oh, what the heck? What is that? The knives just shot backwards. The dream is falling apart. Take you out. Ah, uh, why did I not play him? Okay. I still should have played him first. That was so stupid of me. That's okay. Arcane Explosion, Arcane Intellect. Let's get Arcane Ex Intellect. Although Explosion and him would be pretty good. That would have actually cleared the whole board. I'm making some poor choices this game. For each enemy minion, restore two health to your hero. Okay. Um play him or bronze beard three four five six seven no let's get him out there emperor let's clear that bad boy i want to get the combo where i drop bronze beard and mage that'll give me four spell damage that'll turn this to eight damage which would give me board control again assuming he doesn't clear it which he's about to yep all right Desperate times call for desperate measures. Bronze beard. Trigger it twice. This gives us five. Oh, we got the board control. Finally. Finally. Okay, I need Yogg. I need Yogg. Otherwise, we're going to lose because we only have three health. Eight health. When he attacks, that's five. He might even have lethal right now. Please don't kill me. Oh, baby. Don't kill him. Don't kill him. Don't kill him. No. Well, we got this. Let's get some draw in here. I need to get Yogg. Goodness. Just drew four cards and I still didn't get them. <sighs> hmm. This would be a good card with the brand combo. That'd be four spell vamp. Double it. Eight. Ten damage. Hey, we're still in it. Ooh. Sylvanas. That's going to be tricky. 
Oh my goodness, it's still not here. Okay, well, two to three. Let's clear that guy. Clear him. Let's get an Emperor out, because I don't think he'll be able to kill Sylvanas. Where should I cast my Fireball? I'll just cast Fireball. Because this way we'll have lethal if you can't clear my board. And I don't know if you can. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 12. Oh, no, that's, no, that's 13 exactly. So I have perfect lethal right now, assuming he doesn't kill any minions. But I wonder if he might kill his Sylvanas. Although none of my minions could kill it, so he would have to kill it himself. And he still might not get what? What? Summon your death rattle minions that died? What the heck? What? Eleven. No. If I had one more spell. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. I have twelve. Wow. Amazing. Maybe he'll do something dumb and play some minion that will help me. I don't know. I don't know. The disrespect. I can't believe it. I've never seen a card like that, and that's incredible. Come on, clear my minions and play something like a sludge. Well, that'll do it. Incredible. Alright, we didn't get Yogg, but I hope you guys enjoyed watching this, and if you like the Hearthstone videos, leave a like, and I'll keep them coming.